welcome to Falcon Focus with your hosts Springer DeRozier and Alexis Hawley. Sports with Brandel Diaz and Tyson Abbott. Dayton Elliott and Heidi Brown reporting live. And West Burlington's number one skit team. Here's Springer and Alexis. Ho, ho, ho. Happy holidays, West Burlington. Whether it's Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, or just celebrating winter, we hope that you're ready for the holidays. Outside the snow is falling, friends are calling you. Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together, but not with you, Springer. Thanks, Alexis. This episode is about winter, the holidays, men's and women's basketball, and wrestling, which brings us to Falcon Sports. Welcome back to Falcon Sports. I'm Brandel Diaz alongside Tyson Abbott, and we're here to tell you what's happening in West Bunk Falcon Athletics. And they say I don't read the prompter right. Well, I'm Fiddy Tyson. My name's actually Tyson Abbott, though. And here's the news. Falcon basketball is in full swing at the turn of the year here as we've hit the halfway point of the season. Both programs have really grown from last season and are building on from each other from the beginning of the year. You said it, Tyson. On Friday, December 20th, both the Lady Falcons and Falcons play host to our arch rivals, the overrated Danville Bears. It's not very nice. I guess it's true, though. It's JVN Varsity, so let's fill up the Falcon nest. WBNDD Wrestling has been going strong, ironically adding Danville and Notre Dame to our numbers. Our WB competition dance team went to state December 5th, and they placed third against some very good teams. We talked with camera shy sophomore Haley Snyder about their recent competition. She felt that no matter what place they received, she was, quote, happy with how far the team has come since their first practice, end quote. She, like the entire school, is proud of their hard work. Great job, dance team. Due to time constraints, we do not get the opportunity to interview our student body. Much apologies. In national news, at the beginning of December, Auburn upset number one Alabama with an exciting field goal return. Here's a footage from that game that I actually watched. Seven yards. Number eight blocked, kick can go the other way too. He's got to be careful and get it up. On the way. No, return by Chris Davis. Davis goes left. Davis gets a block. Davis has another block. Chris Davis. No flags. Touchdown. Auburn. An answered prayer. Playoffs are right around the corner for NFL and NCAA football as the Iowa Hawkeyes play the LSU Tigers in the Outback Bowl. Well, this is all from us with Falcon Sports. Coming up after these messages is our reporters and later, funny web videos. Get hype, baby. Hype. Oh, hi. Raise the roof. Does soaring really get you a Gatorade? Does Mr. Gurrius really hate curls? Oh, those muscles! <laughs> hey, knock that off. Oh, nice. <laughs> no curling. Hey, no curls. Hey, hey, hey. hey what did I say about curls in the weight room? And now for our top story. Top sales during Christmas time has fallen since 1950. Barbies, monster trucks, and books. The collective effort of the Spanish art and science clubs had a toy drive for the Toys for Tots this past November. Children around the world are positively affected by the work of the, ch of the charities like Toys for Tots. Please donate to your local charities during the holidays for those who have none. Recently, West Burlington did our own version of a holiday celebration. Our elaborate sword door decorations were a hit, ranging from Moffat's holiday campaign poster, Mr. Adam's Nightmare Before Christmas theme, Miss Schnell's naughty and nice stockings, and the awesome Santa Claus in the library. This season's sore activity was one of for the books. And speaking about Christmas gifts and decorations, with the holidays right around the corner, here's Dayton and Heidi getting the thoughts about the holidays around the school. Gerard, what are you doing for the holidays this year? 
I'm gonna be with my family. Family? <laughs> I'm gonna be spending the holidays with my uh, wife and sons. Okay. Going to the gym. <laughs> Typical. <laughs> Nothing. Staying at home. What do you want for a Christmas present? Probably money. Ooh, that's a good one. I want um <laughs> want stuff for my rats. Rats! <laughs> I knew you were gonna say rats. <laughs> I just got a new guitar and that's my Christmas gift this year. Ooh. Uh tub of protein. <laughs> my god. I want Santa Claus to get me a bicycle. I don't know. Lots of stuff. One thing. He's thinking if he should say it or his daddy's know. gonna get it. <laughs> <laughs> um, probably baseball gloves. What was the worst present you've ever gotten? Probably an ugly sweater for my grandma. Typical. Jeans. <laughs> Jeans that don't fit. From your grandma. A real <laughs> paisley looking turquoise um, turtleneck sweater. Uh, I was like a box of smelly cologne, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> My mom made me a sweater. <laughs> what a cheapskate. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know if I ever had a bad Christmas present. Do you just <laughs> ask your dad to see it? No. <laughs> Fifth through high school band and choir concerts were the 16th and 17th of December, with Miss, Mr. Eveleth and Miss Cook's musicians displaying their grand talents in the form of festive holiday carols. In national news, the Obamacare website is finally, finally working at full capacity with no issues. December 14th was the anniversary of the tragic Sandy Hook shooting, killing over 20 elementary students. In what I believe to be bad taste, the founder of the Second Amendment Foundation created Gun Save Lives Day the day after the anniversary. Let us spend every day giving respect and remembrance to those who have died, and not let politics get new town or any other town. South African leader Nelson Mandela died at the beginning of the month as the former prisoner turned president overthrew the devastating apartheid in Africa. We'll be right back with funny web videos and Falcon trivia after these messages. His charm is so contagious, vaccines have been created for it. At the museum, he's allowed to touch the art. He bowls overhand. He has never relied on mistletoe. When he was younger, he built a city out of blocks. Today, they call it Chicago. He is the most interesting man at good old WB. I don't normally drink Gatorade, but when I do, it's because I soar. Keep soaring, my friends. Roadrunner Records presents A Clement's Cozy Christmas. Guest starring Tyson Abbott III. I'm actually the fourth. The fourth. Featuring such standards as... Chestnuts, chestnuts roasting, roasting on, an on an open fire. fire. Jack, Jack Frost, Frost is, is biting, biting your, your nose. nose. And who could forget... And everyone's favorite Moffins, cats, Moffins, cats, Lord, I'm the running away. Oh, what fun it really isn't because he has no cats. Yay! Also featuring. Christmas! Merry Christmas! A Clements Cozy Christmas. In national news, a bipartisan congressional team negotiated a budget for the upcoming year. When asked about the new budget, President Obama said a few words. Take a look. A few words. In upcoming school news, let's cue the groans. 
Finals are Thursday and Friday, the 19th and 20th. Be sure to get good sleep and eat some healthy breakfast food. And now it's time for Focus Hashtags. Hit it! This time our tweet is weird holiday traditions and funny holiday songs. So let's get started. For weird holiday traditions, Roger Zink says, After unwrapping a present, we ball up the paper and throw it at the ceiling fan and cheer when someone gets hit in the nose. Ziggy D said, After our Christmas dinner, my family gets out of cuff to see whose blood pressure is the highest. Alexis M. Holly says, Santa will be the one bringing you cookies. For new holiday songs, MJ Swartz said, Bohemian Rhapsody. E. Holla said, Barfing around the Christmas tree. Anita G. said, All the Jingle Ladies. Mama Luke and Nine, Pour some eggnog on me. Dan Coney, Hold me closer, Tiny Prancer. Renover One says, Slay Jude. Jack Lena said, Purple Reindeer. And Steph Kirk says, I got 99 problems, but a Grinch ain't one. And last but not least, Rudolph says, She gon' shake it like my red nose. Wow, folks. I... I can't believe this. Do you see this? And now it's time for the poll of the day. 45% said, nuh uh, while 55 said, yes, huh. That was your poll of the day. And now for your polar of the day. That was your polar of the day. Our next two segments are something we feel are very popular among our viewers. Here is funny web videos and Falcon trivia. Whoa, back up. Stop playing, I'm dead serious. I got a girlfriend, calm down. What's wrong with him? Ooh, I'm white. Stop doing heroin. What does Barack say? Hi, I'm Zach Efron, and this is how you walk sassy. You gotta work and work and work and fierce. Girls be like duck face, selfie, workout swag. Where are you, Christmas? Why can't I find you? She was Hannah Montana when Bush was president. Thanks, Obama. <laughs> Listen, you pretty redneck. I'm taking your banjo. Come on, don't. That's not cool. He needs his banjo for the talent show. Mm -hmm. Man, that's no fair. All I have is a guitar. Can you get a banjo? Boom, boom, boom. We got that boom, boom, pow. Boom, boom, boom. They tried to cap my swagger. I encompass and I eclipse. <laughs> got the hiccups. I'm friends with the monster, the son of my bed. Get along with the voices. Why are you disturbing my class? Oh, right. Scooby Doo, that's just a reflection. Oh. <laughs> The weather outside is horrible! The weather is terrible! It's easy, just dance. The vet said, dude, he said, your cat's just pregnant. I said, okay, so I won't go and kick her. When is St. Nick's birthday? Uh, you ask me questions, I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> Oh wait, hold on. No, you don't oh, cheat. It's, 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 it's 25th, right? No, that's not. No, that was not good. January 1st. Yeah. Oh, yeah. so close, but close enough. Mm. December something. 25th. Um, yeah. December 31st? Santa Claus is a birthday. Saint Nick! <laughs> is that Santa Claus? Yeah. Why <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> well, you learn something every day? <laughs> <laughs> what country was the first to have a Christmas tree? America. 
to actually use Christmas trees, let's say Great Britain? Nope. England? <laughs> uh. Germany? Oh, good job. Uh, Nigeria. <laughs> <laughs> How many ghosts are in a Christmas carol? Twelve. Okay. Three. Four. Ooh, you got that one. Three, four. Everyone picks three. Three, four, I don't know. Six. Three. Three. Everybody guesses that. What president banned Xmas trees in the White House? John F. Kennedy. <laughs> Teddy Roosevelt. Obama. <laughs> what is the only reindeer that is named after another animal? I only know one reindeer. Rhymes with what is it? It's Fonzo. What? Vixen. <laughs> Rudolph? I don't know. <laughs> Cute. Oh no, Cupid's not an animal. It's no. a person. <laughs> and I don't know. That's Valentine's Day. What did the traffic cop holler to Frosty the Snowman? Stop. Oh. You almost freeze. <laughs> Funny. Stop. Oh, you got him. Freeze. Oh. What he said? Frosty the Snowman? Yeah. Joke. Stop! <laughs> you keep cheating. What did the traffic cop holler to Frosty the Snowman? Stop! Stop. Stop. Yay! <laughs> Our last story of the afternoon is a big one. Oh my god, just look at it, it's huge! Well, that's all the time we have. I'm Springer DeRozier. Stay classy, West Burlington. Like usual, I'm Alexis Holly, and I don't get the last word. Thanks for stopping by. Stay classy, West Burlington. Springer DeRozier. Thanks for stopping by. But mainly stay classy. Springer Derosier. And thanks for stopping by. Stay classy. Springer Derosier. Falcon Pride. Merry Christmas, West Burlington, and a Happy New Year. Stay classy. <laughs>